Hey everybody, the Bong is back. Welcome to part 7 of Let's Play Newtopia for the TurboGrafx-16, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Now, I see the entrance to Dungeon 5, but it's not revealed, unfortunately, so we are going to have to look for it. Let's try looking around the rest of Sea Spear. We don't have much of a choice, anyway. Die, stupid Zora ripoffs. No! I hate when that happens. It's like you can't get hit without ta taking too much damage. Or I can't walk around without taking a lot of hits. I mean, but my sword is so small and my sprite is so big, of course I'm gonna take hits. It's, epi it's epidemic. God, this sword is still quite weak. Hopefully, I'll get a new one soon. Let's see what's in here. The first crypt is to the south of here. It is very difficult to find the entrance because the goons have hit it well. Use your compass at all times. The charm compass is the force of the medallions. Didn't help, did it? Hey. Seems like a dead end. But I bet you there's something there. Let's take a look. What the? A dungeon? Oh, this is... Oh, well, I already got wings anyway. Ah, there we go. Let's see what's over here. Hopefully we find something good. Welcome! My name is Orion. I'm a bit tied up right now. No oh, shit. But perhaps I can help you. Dirth has locked me up because I know the secrets of this labyrinth. Listen closely. Push the red stone over there and you'll be on your way to the crypt of the medallion. Oh, Gisetta, you alone can save me from these chains of death. If you could only capture the medallion from inside the crypt, I would be free. Please do all that you can. My life hangs in the balance. Uh, no pressure, you know that? Well, I pushed the red stone. I guess the way to crypt 5 is open. Oh no, I'm not fighting you guys again. There, now I just gotta head all the way back. It's not too long of a trek anyway. It's just annoying when there's too many enemies there to deal with. Like these, for instance. Okay, I got an opening. Perfect. Ah, huh, there we go. Alright, now we're in Dungeon 5. Ew, blue sperm samples. I must kill him. Yo-Yo Power! Alright, now let's look around. Oh, it's dark. And those blue, those red stones are traps, I know it. Alright, let's see if I can blow this wall up with a bomb. No, I can't. Ow! Oh, slugs. Okay, if you say so. They shouldn't take too long to dispatch. Well, they're quite easy anyway. Okay, now can I blow this wall up? No, I can't. Alright, let's just look around and see if we can find some treasure. So far, I'm not doing too good in that department. Oh, great. Oh, good, I can block those shots. Just as long as I don't attack. Oh, those sprites are too close. I 
Okay, they're not going to shoot me at all. I'll just stab them then. Okay, can I blow this up? No, I can't. How about any of these walls? How about this one? Ah, I can blow both of those up. Cool. Okay, this is another one of those pointless rooms. Okay, not necessarily. I can look in this one. Oh, damn it! Damn it! Collision damage is the worst damage to take. It's kind of funny that even if they're hopping in air and it doesn't look like they're touching me, they do. Oh, good, more bombs. Can I blow any of these walls up? Or is this just a lost cause? Okay, well, it's not really a lost cause. I can go in here. But I love chest. One that I can't reach. Unless I went over here to the other side. But wait, I haven't really blown up these other walls. That would explain why you can't. Okay, then I'll just grab the chest in here. Oh! Oh, crystal ball. Oh, there's the map. But sadly, I'm low on health again. Surprise, surprise. Um, I think we'll go upward and to the left. No! God! Health is so scarce. At least in Zelda 1, there's plenty of places to get health. The hearts are nowhere close to rare. But in this game, you'll be lucky to get health at all. It's like totally unbalanced for difficulty. I mean, some of the bosses are easy, but some of the dungeons are hard. This all boils down to what registers as a hit. Really? Can I blow this up? No, I can't. I only do this to save my bombs. Uh oh. Uh, I can be over here. That's safe. Yeah, I can blow this up. Cool. Uh, this is the way to the boss. Can I blow this wall up then? Ah, yes I can. Who are you? I hope you have found the silver sword hidden within the chambers of this labyrinth. The demon boss in this spear is ugly indeed, and he is also very powerful. He seems to be weak in the head, though, so aim for his mouth when he opens it. Ah, thanks for the hint, boss. Oh good, I can blow this wall up too. He looks like a skeleton turtle. Oh my. With the head of a bull, but the body of a turtle. Very weird looking enemy. Um, what if I explored upward to the north? If I'm gonna keep going north, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna find something that's useful. No! 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 I am not dying. Yeah, there's too many enemies here. And I bet you not one of them will give me a cherry. Well, if no enemies give me a single cherry, I'm gonna be super pissed. Come on, give me at least one. Cause I'm all out of medicines. Give me something. 
Anything other than an item I don't need. Oh, yeah, money. Yeah, that's really gonna help. Yeah, I can heal with money. Let me eat this coin. And not one enemy gave me anything. No! What's gonna happen if I die? It sends me all the way back here! Fuck that shit! I'm not going all the way back. All because one little sperm sample killed me. It's just not gonna happen! Oh no. Oh no. I am not dying like this. Well, if I get the sword and then I die, well then it's no big deal. As long as I get the sword. Then if I die, I'll gladly take the death, go back, get some medicine, and then come back and attempt this dungeon again. Yeah, I'll do that. Like, I don't mind that. It's just the fact that you can't even start over in the beginning of the dungeon itself. That annoys me. I don't think I lost any money either, which was a good thing. Oh, bullshit! There! Now I got the silver sword. And I died anyway. Oh yeah, you lose like half, almost half your money. But at least now I can get the uh, silver swords take with me. Anyways, I'm going to stop the video right here. Next part, I'm going to attempt Dungeon 5 again. Alright, goodbye everyone.